meme review again. Again, because we just got more info on Albedo and the next banner after the uh, the next banner we're having that's going to replace the Zhongli banner. We just got more info uh, and a couple of other things as well. The Chalk Prince and the Dragon event take part in obtaining the exclusive sword Festering Desire. We already knew we had this, this sword is going to be there. Um, so you just kind of read through this. During the event, travelers are going to obtain the event exclusive sword. And you can complete the events, primary gems, more. You can also unlock the special abilities, especially in the side, which provides a certain buff to the event while adventuring in the new monster area. So it's not a new um, main area. It looks like it's a part of monster. That answers my last questions of, of a new Archon. If it's monster, it looks like we won't have new Archon. Uh, complete various challenges in the Dragon Spine area to obtain SSS. That can be then, then can be exchanged in the event shop for Festering Desire to find material, Festering Dragon Marrow, and the Talent Level Up Material, Crown of Vincite. We saw these in the last uh, thing that we looked at. Duration after the version 1.2 update. So it's, so it's coming in version 1.2 and it's gonna last until the 5th of January, it looks like. And then shop will last until the 12th of January. You have to be AR20 or above to be able to do this uh, and complete the prologue act two for a tomorrow without tears. Push prerequisite for story quest, complete a Vados story quest Princeps Cretaceous to unlock the Chalk Prince and the Dragon event. During the event, the Prince will not be re will not require a story key to unlock. So it looks like this will unlock without a key. So if you don't if you don't have keys, looks like you're fine. To opening time, we already know this. As soon as 1.2 hits, we already know that eventually rank 20. Once the event ends, it will require adventure rank 40 or above. The completion of the prologue, this and the story key to unlock. So, this means you gotta do it during the event, or, or if you do it after, you're gonna have to, like, I guess, kind of pay more. You're gonna have to pay a story key. And if you're not AR 40, you're gonna have to grind for it. So, kind of better to, to do it now that. Um, that you don't need all this but you know if you can't do it because you're not there yet what can you do click one the complete challenge storyline to obtain the event exclusive we didn't know that let's get fight rhyme war fragments and rhyme worn crystals and dragon spider after act one opens collect rhyme war fragments rhyme worn Crystals to complete, to complete the related quest to obtain primogenitors and more. Enhance Fester and Desire to obtain weapon essential materials and other rewards. No longer will yield. Once the event ends, exploration will no longer yield rhyme worn fragments or rhyme worn crystals and quest materials in your inventory will disappear. Fragments, fragments and crystals are event exclusive items and will disappear after the 6th of January next year. So, you know, just like the kind of meteors from the official event, it looks like this, um, this material will only be here for the event. So you, you got to grind those doing that to, I guess, kind of get the free sword, you know? Mm hmm. Looks like you can, you might just get one sword, which is kind of, kind of sad that you can just get one, but you know, one is better than nothing, right? The Chalk Prince and the Dragon 
Act 2. Glittering Essence Testing Grounds Challenge. Act 3. We'll open the 28th. So Act 2 will be like 25th of December and Act 3 the 28th. Mm, act 4, 31st. So these are kind of like the challenges apparently. Do period use weapon enhancement experience. Basically, basically kind of the same as as the official event. You gain more, you gain more material. If your war level is like higher, you gotta get the material um, during the event, and you can exchange it at the shop um, open during the event. Event wish epitome. It looks like this is the new um banner event weapon banner um coming up we got the geosaur it looks like summit sharper summit shaper skyward atlas so this one the book summit shaper looks like this is a new weapon um probably for a beta it looks like a geo uh weapon just like geo looking weapon just like the ones we had for like zhongli and xinyang um, and then some other weapons. Trunks. I don't know if people will be getting this, but yeah, you know, looks like we only get one new weapon, uh, which is gonna be for Albedo pretty much. Two, two and boosted. We already know that boosted. Test run, and this is like, this is it, right? This is the new banner. We're gonna go through the new banner. Wish a banner, new banner, Secretum Secretorum, new wish available. All right, so characters that will come in the new banner have been released. We already knew it was, it was going to be Albedo for the five star, um, and Sucrose as well because it was, it was in the one point two um trailer and stuff. But <clears throat> but now we know that Fischl is going to be there and Banner is going to be there. Which are not bad characters, you know. Bennett is kind of like a favorite for a lot of people because his abilities are crazy. And Fisher was that's pretty, pretty good also. Um, no new characters though, so I don't know if that's kind of like a let down for people, but it's kind of nice. Uh, kind of like a nice banner, you know. It's no Kaya or or. Uh, Amber. So, you know, if people want to get the constellations for these new characters, now they can wish for that. Personally, I don't think I'll be wishing a lot of this, if at all. Because uh, I'm mostly free to play. Uh, so we'll see. But yeah. Next banner is going to be Albedo. Official. Sucrose and Bennett. After that, it looks like Albedo will not be available in the standard wish. If you're working on these characters, um, if you want these characters, make sure to start, you know, getting the materials from the bosses and essential material and all of that. You'll be good. Uh, but yeah, now we know the next banner. And that means we'll be able to test run Albedo, Fischl, Sucrose, and Bennett. Um, I already have all three of them, um, so I know, I kind of know how they work. I don't really use, really use them. I know Ben is like maybe the most popular between them. Um, I don't use them currently cause free to play don't have that much material, but Hey, if you use them, if you want to use them, get them. Mm, also new battle pass, same weapons. It looks like. So if you're getting that battle pass again, if you're considering buying it, no new weapons, uh, same weapons, but if you bought it before, you can use them for uh, refinement or for new characters. But yeah, Avenger rank 20 above to unlock it. Um, you can buy it if you want, or you can do the free stuff. Either way, it's the good stuff. Um, and it refreshes with the update. Adventures, booster bundles, run to available limited time. 
Uh, I don't know about these Genesis crystals. You have to buy those if you if you want to buy those. Buy them if you're free to play. You know, I don't think you're interested in that too much. But yeah, looks like that's gonna be it. Uh, we get the event for Dragon Spine. Uh, to obtain the new sword, you gotta do this stuff during the event, or it's gonna be like impossible or more difficult once the event is over. New banner, only one sword uh, is new for Albedo, probably. And we got the new wish banner uh, Albedo, Official, Sucrose, and Bennett, and which means we'll get to test those. Anyways, I will see you later. That's gonna be it. This is the new banner stuff. Uh, yeah, I'll see you later. Peace.